Well, you may notice a bad smell when driving on the roads these days. It's that time of year when one particular animal is on the move looking for love. Dejiana Wilson joins us now with more on how to clear the air when things get unpleasant. Marvin and Andrea, we're talking about skunks. It's breeding season for the stinkers, and you should expect to see them more often. I spoke with experts who had some advice that may keep you or your pet from having to take a bath in tomato juice. You may have noticed the small black and white striped animal on the side of the road, near forest edges, or hear sounds coming from under your home. It's breeding season for skunks, so the Romeos are roaming. The mostly nocturnal animals are on a mission to find their mate, traveling four to five miles at a time, which makes them more likely to be struck by cars and raised in a stink. It may, you know, kind of be in its own little world and not necessarily aware that a car is approaching and, and, and you know, setting its you know, goal of finding a mate, so it, it may not be in a hurry to get out of the way. Laura Palmer with the Kentucky Department of Fish and Wildlife says this is one of the reasons their smell can be so prominent. They also use their spray when they feel threatened. Wildlife removers say at this time of the year, 60 to 70 percent of their calls are because of skunks who have found their ways into homes. And for whatever reason, AC units are probably the, the most popular entry point that they're using to do so. Andy Wells with Complete Animal Removal says when skunks find a home they like, they often stay there and have babies and may return to the same house in future mating seasons if the entry point isn't sealed. Aside from doing the light construction, there's nothing a homeowner could really do to prevent it. It's just kind of an unfortunate circumstance that they chose your house and, and not your neighbors. You may be tempted to take pictures or videos of skunks near your home, but experts say you should hightail it away instead because their spray can go up to 16 feet. Experts say it's also important to keep trash and discarded food items out of reach. If you live in Lexington and need a dead skunk removed from the road, you can call the city's Division of Waste Management. That contact information is on our website, fox56news.com. Marvin and Andrea, back to you.